Hello everyone. Have a nice day. In this video, I will show on how to program pulse type motors in Mitsubishi FX series PLC. This program is applicable in all pulse motors, such as stepping motors, servo motors, and linear actuators. In your GX Works 2 or GX Developer, click Open New. Then select FX CPU and select what type of CPU you are using. and click OK. First we will register our special device comments. In your project workspace, double click global device comment. Then right click on your device comments window. Then select import from sample comments. And click special relay or special register. And click yes. Now we already added our special devices comments. We will program Oriental Motors, CVK Series Stepping Motors. Our CVK Series Stepping Motors has no servo on and alarm reset inputs. So that we will not include servo on and alarm reset in our example program. First we will program 16-bit origin return. You can also use 32-bit origin return depending on your application. We will click device comment icon so that we can directly input our device comments. Then input your device comments. Now we will program our zero return instruction. Click application instruction icon on your ladder toolbar, or just simply press F8. Then type ZRN. You can see here what device type you need to use, but now we will use constant value. Then input your initial zero return speed. Then your creep speed. Then your dog sensor or origin sensor. and your pulse output and click OK here you can input your device comments if you want and click OK take note our ZRN instruction requires continuous operation to operate. Then change your M0 to rising pulse. Then we will add execution complete flag special device. In your global device comment window, find string complete. And our instruction execution complete device is M8029. Then add your instruction execution complete flag. Now we will program our drive to increment. 
or DRVI instruction. DRVI first data is number of output pulses, second is output frequency, third is device number from which pulses are to be output, and the last is device number to which rotation direction signal is output. Y0 is connected to pulse minus of CVK series. Y4 is connected to direction minus of CVK series. Then add your instruction execution complete flag. Our drive to increment or DRVI instruction is now completed. Now we will add our Y0 current value register. Our Y0 current value register is D8340, double word. We can monitor our axis 1 current coordinate here. Now we will program our drive to increment or DRVI instruction reverse direction. Our drive to increment or DRVI instruction reverse direction is now completed. Now we will program our drive to absolute or DRVA instruction. Our set data are the same in DRVI instruction. But now we will use data registry, but you can also use constant value if you want.
Our drive to absolute or DRVA instruction is now completed. Now we will verify our program. Our program is now ready to transfer to PLC.